welcome back. Celon here. Today for you guys, I've built a little Minecraft, uh, little just hidden area, and I want to show you it. So you're going to go into this cave, and look, it's a door. A chest, we want that chest. But how are we going to get through? A button. And now we can get to that chest. So I'm going to show you a tutorial on basically how to make this. So I have made two right here, and I'm just going to show you the tutorial. You're going to need a couple blocks. You're going to need redstone, repeater, and a note block. And let's get ourselves a couple other blocks. First of all, stone and a button. So let's make a day first. Time set day. Okay, so first thing you need to do is this. Simple. And then I made it just an infinite loop. So you need to put out one, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and make sure all the repeaters are on two ticks. And this is a pretty straightforward process. And it has to be on grass, just note that, because if it's not on grass, it will sound odd. Okay, so if you push the button, it'll make a pretty standard sound. Now what you need to do is here, I've put down the order, I have no idea what that came from, but the order is 13, 12, 9, 3, 2, 10, 14, 18. So let's do this first. 13, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Next up, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now we have 9. Again, one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, fourteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and then eighteen. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So now for the final test, simply click the button. As you can see, pretty simple. If you want to make it louder, make multiple ones. But yeah, and then you can put this on like a, like this, um, you make it so that it'll go to, it doesn't have to be exactly like this, but it can be something, I'll show you how, how I make it. So I make an infinite lock repeater, and how to do that is just like this, and then you just simply put it to some sort of a door piston. So I'll use the door for this instance. Then you push the button and the door will permanently be open, which is what I basically have in here. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you all later.